Hi, everybody. I know it's been a long time since I've gone on here, but the room I am right now with all these uh, closets, and I've got a lot of open wall space. Um, this will be my new craft room. I'm hoping to get a lot of, of my looms hung up. And on this wall, you can see where it's really, really plain. I'm hoping to get a shelf that I can put those uh, like baskets or the fabric bins in to put all my yarn so it's not all in my plastic containers. Um, <clears throat> but I'm gonna try, cause when I was on vacation, I went and bought some more yarn. So I'm gonna try to do maybe two to three videos today and get them up on YouTube because it's been a while since I posted. <laughs> and I am so sorry, but with moving and getting my house unpacked, and put it the way I want it to be. I really ain't had time to sit down and actually do some YouTube videos. Um, so yesterday, I got my yarn crush. Um, I will be getting this yarn crush much faster now because I now live in New York and uh, the yarn, the where this gets shipped to is from Niagara Falls. So it's in New York. So I am maybe, maybe a couple hours away. I think, I, I'm not sure. So let's get this open. And so we have June, 2017. Look at these little, uh, what are they called? Parakeets, I think is what they're called. Now, if I'm wrong, please tell me in the, script, in the little thing below so I can correct myself. But this is what I think they are, but I'm not too sure. Okay, Ooh. the goodies. Yarn is a sea lace is sea lace and is a glorious silk and sea, sea cell. It's a blend, it's a lightweight. It's a hand dyed by Handmaiden with glorious 846 yards for steam. Oh. But this it is much, it's darker, not, it's darker off screen. Um, let's see what else. The retail value is $40. This comes in nine colors. Here is the little tag. And then here, on the back is what they recommend you using it with. This is really, really soft. I like it. Um, I'm afraid to use stuff like this because I've taught myself how to knit. Um, I just, I don't know if I'm going to be doing it correctly or not. Like I said, everything I do is trial and error. So that is, it's basically whatever I've made. Hold on, I got to do something right quick. There we go. I just forgot to turn on my overhead light. I forgot I had one um, to just be in touch a new house and during the day I don't turn on the lights because I have the sun to uh, light up my house but the good thing about this room I'll show you after I get all this stuff done I'm just I'm like so excited 
just to tell you about my very own room. But let's get this done first, okay? Um, so the yarn was retailed at $39.99, so about $40. And then these, I have no idea how they perfectly matched this color, but sometimes I find it hard to match colors. It's like if you want it in the same, like almost the same color, but they did a tremendous job on this. This is the beef. See, they both look the same color on the screen, but this is more of a green blue, a bluish green. And so are the beads. They got a little hint of purple in them. It's just, it's really good. Okay, so the notions, about 30 grams of seed beads, hand-picked and coordinated beautifully with your yarn, yarn are included and complete either kit, knit, or crochet pattern. So the retail value of these beads are $3.99. You get a lot of beads for $3.99. Um, okay, let's see, which one's first? The Pineapple Grove. Now this one is by, I think they're all, I think they're both by the same person. Let me see right quick. No, they are not. Joe Anna Rankin. I think that's how I say her name. I know Joanna, but I'm, I'm really sure I'm, it's, I think it's Rankin. I'll flip it over here in a second. Um, but this is the Pineapple Grove shawl. Look at that. And the, there's her name. And then here's the shawl. This is pretty. This is an intermediate. I am not that good. So <laughs> I doubt that I will be doing this uh, pattern. Um, But I do have a friend who loves to knit, and I will give this to her. And, oh my gosh, she could make beautiful stuff. <sighs> so I'll turn this around. Here is the diagram. And then here is some of the other stuff. And then um, to go along with this pineapple growth, we have a pineapple ending chart. You have the graft over here, and then you have the written right here. So to uh, add a bead to each green highlighted stitch, if not adding beads, just knit these stitches. So you see all the green, the green right here? That is where you'll be adding the beads. If not, you're just gonna knit, stitch, you're just gonna stitch these. Okay. Now, if I was much skinnier, or if they gave me like I'm more skiing, I would definitely wear this. This is called a Maui wrap. Look at that. You can also add the beads to these as well. And here's what another picture looks like. And then here's the grid. Now, this is, this is intermediate too, so I would not be able to do this because I have not got the knack of crochet yet. Um, so, wow, we got very soft yarn. We got a pack of beads. We got, we got two, uh, <clears throat> Oh, 
I just had, oh my gosh, my brain just turned off there for a minute. I'm just, I am just so relaxed right now because I'm in, I'm in my, I'm in my restful place right now in my room. We've got two patterns, two awesome patterns. Um, so the knitted, the pineapple grove right here. The estimated, the retail value is $5.99. And the Maui wrap right here is $5.99 as well. So the total uh, retail value of this box was $59.99, I mean, $55.96. And I only paid like $37 for my subscription. Do you get, you get a, what you, get your money's worth. I, I promise you, you do. Um, here in a second, I'm going to flip this around. Um, and if you want to, you can freeze it because I'll give you some coupon. Okay, so let's look at the two patterns again. The beads can go with either pattern. This is the pineapple ending chart. The chart or the words and the yarn. Look at that. Okay, now I'm gonna flip the card around. this like I said just hit pause when that card comes up and use these right away okay um so I hope you have enjoyed everything I have showed you right now so if you have any questions or comments or you can remember what this little bird is right here please tell me because I cannot. It's been such a long time since I've around. been around birds, and birds scare the pajuki out of me. I will just tell you that right now. So, that is all I have. So, until next time from the Mama of Three, bye.